Welcome, welcome. My name is Cody, and recently, I just got word that Rooster Teeth's Monty Alm just passed away, and I'm I'm a little traumatized by that at the moment, and I just wanted to address that, and so I'm going to just do one take, one take only, and I'm gonna address how I feel. Now, Monty, he he's an idol. He was an idol to me in a big way. See, it was cause and effect. I remember watching my first Rooster Teeth video. It was Red vs. Blue, one of his animations, um, season eight, I believe, episode four, with the um, smashing the warthog through the wall. And it was from that point on, you know, I started watching more of Rooster Teeth's work. And uh, it, I just, I, I really enjoyed it. And then finally, years down the road, I decided what I want to do when I grow up is be just like Rooster Teeth. Own a big company, provide game and entertainment for people. And you know, do what do what I want to do. I don't want to be stuck with a desk job, something boring like that. No, I want to live life to the fullest. I I, I I idolized Monty because that's what he did, and he even preached the same thing as well. You know, he said himself, not many people can do what they want to do for a living. And he practically told everyone to, he practically said to go out there, chase your dreams, and, you know, I, asp- I aspire to, to be like that, you know. To be honest, because of Monty, I, I, I really want to expand on the future of Ice Gauntlet and one of the biggest things was animations, and if it weren't for him, I, I wouldn't be here right now. I wouldn't be doing this video, to be honest, because because I I don't know. I wouldn't have watched Rooster Teeth. I mean, I remember I remember I did see a lot of Monty's work earlier before, like Dead Fantasy, and. It was amazing. I'm I'm sad that he wasn't able to finish it. It was it, it was really good. I believe six episodes. I really loved that. Everybody loved that. Um, what else? He passed away, age 33. <sighs> Moving on. Um. So, you know, he left a legacy, and just to get just to get his content out there, just to do what he wanted to do. He loved his job. He loved doing what he did, working animations especially. And I aspire to be just like that too. You know, with animations and such, I'm really big into that. And one day, I want I want to like. Try to be like that. Try to go above and beyond. And I'm really sorry that he has such a short life. But he left a huge impact on me. And, you know, one of the things, one thing I believe is before I die, I'd like to, like, I want to leave a legacy. I don't, I wouldn't like to be forgotten. No. And so, Monty, I'm going to, I'm going to carry carry his legacy in my heart and so he can he'll always be there like with me in spirit and so I, I just don't know what to say I'm, I'm baffled right now I'm just caught news of this um also I'd like to uh, wish his family good luck 
his uh, and the employees, the fans out there. Really good stuff. I don't know. I guess I guess it's time to wrap it up. If you like this video, don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Monty, rest in peace, buddy. You'll be always being here. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.